All right. Tell the folks your name. Sparky Ski. All right. Boy Sparky Ski, the sicker vicar of rap. You know what I'm saying? All right. That's me, Rap Ski Nesbitt. What Represent you got for us today, brother? Representing the Rusty Malky. All right. KLTV UK. King big up Rusty Beats. Malky. Big up J. Ken, King of the Beats. You know what I'm saying? Lawyer Battle Scars, everybody on my UK posse. You know that. Big up my man, Big Cuba. Yes, Big Cuba definitely is in the house. Bro. All right, Spark. You got something special or exclusive here for the peoples? Yeah, it's, it's a little old school flavor, you know what I mean? Just for the B-Boys, because that's where I come from. That's you know what's, what's up, man. So that's uh. Funky kid. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And that's how you do it. You know what? Just you know, I'll, I'll put one more on it. Oh, right, we got a bonus. We got a you bonus, got a folks. Bonus. Treat you out of it, man. You know what I'm saying? All right. I'm just hip hop's gonna come back. The real way, the way it used to be, you know what I'm saying? Well, how would you how would you describe that? What you mean by real hip hop? Real hip hop, you know what I'm saying? Some brain food, something that can uplift your culture, uplift your mind state, you know what I'm saying? Something that helps people think positively and move forward and shake their ass too. Oh. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I definitely know what you're saying. Alright. Oh my god. Are you hurting him with this one, Ski? Yeah. You fucking around, have to bust the rhyme up in here. Huh. Me too. <laughs> yeah. And that's what we're talking about. Real hip hop. All right, all right, all right. I got to thank you, Sparky Ski, for giving us some insight into what it means to be a real beat maker, programmer, b-boy, you know, hip-hop aficionado, <laughs> being being true to the game, you know what I mean? Because I don't know if you feel like I do. I think what's, what's, what's ruined, you know what I mean, the game over the past 10, 15, 20 years is like what it is that we do to make beats, the amount of effort and... and, and, and you know, that goes into, 
you know what I mean, putting together beats like this. You know what I mean? At one point in the game, it was it was kind of exclusive to those people that you know wanted it that bad. Where now technology has made it so that just anybody with a laptop and and a program and some software can can take a record and just select samples and not have a chance to actually absorb and feel the music that they cutting up. You know, it sounds good, so they put it out. Yeah, you know, no, actual I, understanding, and they don't appreciate. It, you know I, what I'm saying? I'm not feeling that. I got a few students. I got a few people I'm mentoring at the moment. And we're all about the vinyl culture. We're all about learning your eras of music, learning your producers, learning your label camps. It's just the same as following all the modern up to date labels. You have to go back and follow, you know what I'm saying? Your stacks, your Motown, your Blue Note, your Blue Phone. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Your Prestige. All of those old type labels and, and suss out who's who on which label and right, right. what you like. Learn it, do the knowledge, you know yeah. what I'm saying? We're going to take it out on this. Yeah. Uh. That's what's up. <laughs> we, about to, we about to do a little... I still, I still got it, man. <laughs> That's what's up. That's it. And we signing off. This is Amadeus coming to you live from Day Sauce over here in the UK, East London. Big up to all my peoples, man. Keep hip hop culture alive. Keep vinyl culture alive. Be yourself. Be a leader. Be creative. Be original. Peace. <laughs>